times okay i had to pull it up because it never look good it look away it look retarded <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. Oh, oh. It is Suzy Cute Things coming to you with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be trying the half up and the half down with the Jade Curl. I am getting my hair ready and prep for this style. What I have done is take out the two side pieces because you know I am struggling with my edges right there. It ball. I'm going to want it no more baller than how it is. So what I am doing now is just getting my hair ready. So I'm going to put, I have my jam, forgot, and I have some gel that I will be pulling in. There is the hair, the Jade Curl, the purple pack. That is what I'm using. And I, I bought two packs just to make sure, you know, I don't go short. So I'm just adding some jam to the part of my hair to just get the flyways and the byways, you know, together. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so prepping my hair and getting it ready now to do the lower uh bond of my hair um you won't be able to see the bun after the hair is on it so yeah you don't have to worry about that to see if you're going to see the bun of your hair because the hair that you're pulling on is going to cover all of that so it's just going to look like nothing is there so just getting my hair ready getting it prepped and you know sleeking it back to make sure i cut my hair last year it's growing back so what i did i broke dry my hair so it's a little bit easier to slip back so here i'm showing you that i'm putting it in the bun and just make sure that you know it's there if you want your bun to be higher or lower that is your choice um However, you want your bun if it wants to be a little bit lower or a little bit higher. But as I said, you won't be able to see it because it's going to be tucked in nicely. So I'm just brushing it in, make sure everything is together and sleep back nicely. Checking it in and to make sure. So now I'm going to get the stocking cap for my hair. Here it is. I'm putting it on. It's like magic. Um, I'm thinking whether I should leave those two pieces out or whether I should put them in. My mouth is wide open like I'm catching a fly. <laughs> oh my gosh, but I decided to put them in and, you know, tuck them in under the stocking cap, which would make it a little bit more easier. But anyway, here it is. I started putting on the hair and um, I start from the bottom of the stocking cap come up but i do it like a horseshoe it was not straight so it come up like it's a formation of a horseshoe and then you just work your way up and you work your way up to it and you just you know keep on adding on the hair to it and you know doing it like a horseshoe again my mouth is kind of like open but hey and i think and then i'm getting the hair the glue onto the hair so you know, I'm putting the glue on, 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 and done. <laughs> so now, oh, I thought I was done. So now I'm just adding the glue to the hair to make sure enough glue is on to the track of the hair. So there it is, and voila, it's going on. So up like that, and what I did, I used something to, uh mark my part so in that way i do not go over my part so as a beginner like myself first time doing this i use something to make sure that i do not go over so a guideline basically what i did i cut a small piece to put in the back of it to give it more volume and with this when you're finished and you think you need more air into it, you can always add more to it to give it more volume to however you want it. So that is what I am doing. And there I turn around and I'm showing it to you how it is. And the marker that I use to, you know, mark the line of my hair so I don't go over that line. So for beginners and first timers, try that. <laughs> it does, it works, okay? 
so this is what i am doing right now so i'm finished with that now i'm on cutting the stocking cap two off hours later i did the part in and cutting around it and you have to be careful so you don't cut your hair and cut whatever else <laughs> okay you just cut the stocking cap itself so finally this piece is you know being a pain in the behind so what i'm doing i'm going back and forth to look in my mirror because it's a little bit harder to look into the phone camera uh doing this so if you see me leaning to one side i'm just looking into the other mirror that is there and i'm just cutting the back piece of the um stocking um cap right here and again you know i'm trying like not to cut the hair and twisting and bending and doing all of that it comes with the territory ladies it comes with it so i'm just looking again in that mirror and switch back fast so i got it patted it down make sure everything looking all cute okay now coming to the top of the hair now i'm going to be prepping that so i'm adding some gel and i'm adding some jam to give it a nice sleek to make sure it's nice and sleek and nothing is in or out of place with the top part because the top is going to be you know more um seen so you got to make sure everything is sleek so what i'm doing i'm sleeking it i'm getting it ready to put into a ponytail a mini ponytail i have the hair wrap right here that i am going to be putting on my hair these you can get at your local beauty supply store or amazon or you can order them from offline so what i'm doing i'm just using the hair wrap now i'm just kind of folding it in to make it double to wrap my mini ponytail here so there you go right now i'm trying to do a shortcut but obviously this is not working so i have to get elastic <coughs> and put it on my mini ponytail right there to hold it in place because obviously i can't braid it because i can't braid now i'm using the wrap to wrap my hair and wrapping it and wrapping it to secure my hair to secure the ends of your hair to make sure you, there's no damage to your hair my voice is kind of rusty i don't know why i guess it's the morning time but yeah as you can see here i'm just wrapping it and then what i do i wrap it up and then i wrap it come down up and down wrap it up and wrap it down wrap it up and wrap it down 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 wrap it up hey, wrap it up wrap it up hey, wrap it up wrap it up and wrap it down hey and then once you finish with the wrapping and stuff like that you just add some glue up here to the top was a struggle okay it was a challenge and i have so i had to like redo it like three times before i get okay so finally i've done the top part so here i'm just fixing it fluffing it and prepping it and stuff like that right now i'm doing the size of my hair as you can see you know yeah a bit of ball spot right there so what i'm going to do the hair that i had left out i'm going to use that to camouflage it and you know make it look like hair is actually there so that is what i am doing here right now to get the hair together so i'm struggling there a bit but i got it and just making it looking cute you know the breeze would you know sing in my hearing Ooh, child yes okay this is it you guys this is the finishing touch of the half up and the half down of my hair now here is the take on this okay the back part was fine you know going good and everything i'm getting my little part and the tails and things them right here on my hair you know i lose uh, here on my edges so i tried to camouflage it by bringing over some of the hair that i have left out 
but what I think I did, I think I take out too much of the side here. So I had a bit more here, here. But what I did, I just kind of gel it, bop, 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 and you're good to go. Right? See, I guess so. Oh, it's a headache. But anyway, I kind of fix it. Well, I... So I kind of fix it to make it camouflage so it doesn't look as scanty <laughs> or as bald as how it looks okay i don't know i tried everything and it's not going back so you know i have to come up with some form of remedies to see this side here this side is fine but this side is just ridiculous but anywho um doing this it had it good and it had it bad doing the back part was fine but it's when i get to the top uh. of here and blowing the tip of the hair to the tip of the um the wrap thingamajig that I used to wrap the hair was a challenge. I did it like three times. Okay, I had to pull it up because it never looked good. It looked away. It looked retarded. Just too much. So I redid it over and I got it the way how I wanted. I used two pack of the hair that um that i showed you guys so there's a fly in here so this is the result of it i like it it's cute it's simple quick ready to go um how long can you keep this in you can keep it in for a week two weeks however long you want but i thought i said you know what yes girl you're looking cute and I like it. I like hairstyles that is just quick, easy to go. Something that I can try myself because I saw another um, influencer doing it. And I said I wanted to try it. Looking at it, it looks easy. Doing it yourself, it was a challenge. And I think that I, you know, I think the more I do um, styles like this, the better I become at it. Because yeah the braidless crochet loving it loving it loving it and then i saw this and i said i had to try it for my first time it's not bad for the first time it is not bad at all don't forget you guys to subscribe share and like comment down below and let me know you know if you like my little half up half down jade curl okay i will see ya with one eye yeah. <laughs>